Okay, okay. How are you? Did you get any good advice from Mr. Settles over there? Um, not, not really. Just talking, talking about my, my growth basketball wise. Kofi, you guys as a team, you know, this is a big game for you guys after a big road win, not having a letdown. How do you guys keep that energy up and, and keep that consistency to get another one? On the same way, we have been, um, we've been really good locking in on um, details, little details, and scouts. I'm watching a lot of films, so that's basically it. That's preparation, making sure that we come in and we put up exercise and basically prepare right. What kind of adjustments have you made on the, the high, low, and as you've learned what teams are looking for to intercept it? How have you changed what you do? Not really. I just just been fo more focused on get sprint, sprinting out the ball screens, you know, making sure I get eye contact with my point guards. We haven't changed a lot. It's, it's been the same thing. Just a quicker, like a better pace, I would say. Rutgers is a physical team up front. Just uh, talk a little bit about how you guys plan to neutralize that. Oh, yeah, they're really physical. Um, I was, when I was watching the film, um, the big men are really big. They're really physical. Um, we just have to match the intensity. We have guys just like them, me and Georgie. Kipper, we have guys just like them that are really strong. So we just have to match the intensity and make sure they don't, they don't over our players. What do you feel like has been clicking with the ball screen action? You ran a lot of it at the end of the Wisconsin game with you and Io, and it seemed to really, really click. I think this connectivity, um, we connect a lot because we do it over and over again in practice. And I feel like we trust each other and we have that bond where we trust each other and we're, we're willing to make that extra pass at all times. So that's been the main, the main benefit. Game every three days. Mm -hmm. Uh, how, what, is, what are you experiencing physically here through this rigor of a Big Ten season? Uh, nothing really physically. Uh, we get time to recover. We get we, we have good strength and conditioning coach. So like, um, it's been it's been a lot of pressure at first, but now I'm getting used to it. It's been okay. We have great recovery. So I'm not feeling mm -hmm. What's the challenge for you against Rutgers? Challenge for me, um, it's not getting outplayed, not taking plays off. Um, I did that a little bit in my previous game, so now I just have to focus in, make sure that I'm always in tune in what's going on and not like slacking off. You guys were able to avoid the letdown at Wisconsin. Yeah. What are some things you did, feel like the team did well in that game that you can do again? I think that we're used to um, pressure right now. We've, we've been in that situation two times before, so now we we handled it better. Um, we were more more calm, more composed. And I think that guys just came out there not timid and actually did what they had to do, um, run the plays right, execute well. You know, there's more confidence that has come from the Purdue and Wisconsin wins? Mm, definitely, yeah. More con we're way more confident now, and we're way more focused, like I said. That. Well, what does that confidence look like on the basketball court, whether it be in practice or in a game? How, how can people tell that you guys have that yeah, confidence? Um, just by the speed, um, the, way we, the way we run, the, the pace, um, the confidence is like, like going at the rim, attacking the rim, and making sure that we're on the offensive rebound. And back on defense, just talking, communicating, making sure guys are in the right spots, dumping into the ball. A lot of teams looking for road wins in this league. They're hard to get. How important is it to establish that you don't get one coming into this building? Mm, yeah, um, yeah. good teams win at home. That's been in my mind, my mindset the whole time since I've been here. So we just have to come out there and play our best at home and make sure we protect the rep. Do the fouls you know, in these last couple of games concern you, Kof, or do you feel like you've, you've gained a confidence in learning how to play with two and three yeah. and four fouls? It doesn't concern me anymore. Uh, I mean, I have guys, we're, really, we're a deep team, and I have guys that are just going to come in and they're going to match, match the intensity and make sure they don't let down. So I'm not really worried about it. I'm, obviously, I'm going to try and stay the foul trouble, but I know I have guys. I trust my guys to go in there and, get, and hold it down. It doesn't look like your ankle is taped today. Did you have it? Did it slow you down at all when you against Purdue? Nah, not really. Is the trainer do an amazing job on you? Yeah, it's always taped, yeah. My, 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 my guy, Paul, man. Kofi, did you watch a lot of Rutgers when you were in high school, being on the same coast or anything? Did you, did you get a, a just know what their identity is or anything? Mm, no, no, not really. Thanks. Yep. Thanks, Kofi. Thank you.